Hello and welcome back everyone. This is the Quest Master Shreyansh on the Quest Introduction to Rust. In this specific sub-quest, we'll be discussing control flow. So we'll start off by discussing the if-else of ladder. And to explain this clearly, I'll take an example where let's say if a number we define is 1, we print out u1. So let's start by declaring the variable itself. We'll call that num, of course. And we'll follow that with if num is double equal to 1, we'll print l in u1. Now the double equal to returns true if the number on the left hand side is equal to the number on the right hand side. Let's try executing this and what we see is that because the condition matched, we printed out u1. Excellent. Moving on, let's say if the number is 1, we print out u1. Otherwise, we'll print out u lost. We do that by adding the else clause. In this case, we'll add another print and macro which will print out u lost if the number is anything apart from 1. So number 1, we print out u1. Otherwise, everything between these curly braces is executed. Now, let's change the number to test out if our logic works. We'll move on to the terminal here and we'll do cargo run again. And we see it says u lost. So now let's say we change our condition that if the number is 1, print out u1. Or if the number is 2, you print out try again. And if the number is anything apart from these two, we'll print out u lost. The way you do that within Rust is you add the else if clause. So you can have as many else ifs as you want. In this case, we'll add one just after the first condition. And we'll say else if the num is double equal to 2. Let me just clean that really quickly there. We'll print out try again. Let me just clean up the code here really quickly. And what's going to happen is because the num is defined as 2, it'll first check if the number is 1. It's not. It'll move on to the next branch, which is else if the number is 2. It'll be true and it'll print out try again. And when we run this, we see try again. Beautiful. Let's change the number to 3 and let's see if this works. Moving again, cargo run and we see you lost. Excellent. 